detail of the word of God, that's a miracle. But five naira, headache. If that's all the miracle you've got, I don't think we'll meet in heaven. Welcome to the moment of truth. You just heard Mr. Kumuyi how he was manipulating his members. That was in his early days before they captured the minds of millions. Now he's boasting that he has two million members. So they use heaven to cage millions of people. So instead of them telling you that he, you will be delivered by the pure, purity of your hands. That's what the scripture says. Scripture puts it that way. He will be delivered by the purity of his hands. Then another, uh, you remember the scriptures of the 10 virgin. So only five made it because the rest five, they couldn't carry to the hand. Their lamp went off. So why they went to buy another uh, oil before they came back, the Lord returned and they closed the door. So the five, the other five that had their lamp, see Bonnie, they, had, they begged them to give them some oil. They say, no, you just have to go and buy it yourself. So that shows you that nobody can take you to heaven. It's the purity of your hands. Your connection with the Almighty God, your obedience with the Almighty God is not miracle, it's not giving, it's not tie heads, it's not all the lies Kumuyi and the rest have been telling people. You know why I'm angry about all this thing is that they lie to them, they cage their destiny, and they still collect all their money on top. So, two things they did to humanity. They made them poorer because they collected all their money. On top of that, they still destroyed their destiny. If they only collect money and they let their destiny blossom, you know, I won't have problem with them. Oh. I will not have problem with them. Now, let me read the comment of one of the members that left um, Kumuyi Church. You know, I was a member as well. So... This lady wrote, because when you realize that, that's woman being for you. When they realize that they've been fooled, they've been lied to. This person lied to me in the name of the Lord. And at the end of the day, it destroyed my life. People will fight back. And that's what is happening now. People fighting back. And another, pe another, another person wrote that the meaning of deeper life is actually hair fire. So I will take it one by one. So this person wrote, I left the Palace Church where Mr. Kumuyi brought worship women, singers, onto his pulpit, fully decked with earrings and bangles. And you know, Kumuyi Church in the 90s, you dare not. Even in the UK, you mustn't wear anything. You just have to be natural. A lot of people that I know that are supposed to be in a glorious job, a glorious job in the UK, but because of their dressing, because Oyibo don't understand all this madness. They know the Bible. Bible didn't put us in bondage. It is man-made. So they look at, because the, your dressing is part of your uh, of the interview qualification that will make you. To, to qualify for that position. A lot of graduates are jobless. At the end of the day, they are frustrated because you have to tie your head. No earrings, no makeup, nothing. You just appear there. Like, a, like, 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 like I don't want to describe it. Our skin already is already, is already irritating the white people. And when you now refused to, 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 to make yourself appealing, to make yourself good look, good, good, good looking. You appear nice. Then you had more to the problems. So a lot of people are just losing jobs, losing interviews and all that. So that's what I know. 
Kumu, you preach that in the 90s. Cage a lot of destiny. But now, this woman now said that he now invites all these people on his pulpits. So, when in the church, I was not even allowed to make my baby, my, my baby hair with breeds, uh, with beads. Can you imagine? They will say you are worldly. We were almost made to alienate our family members because they are unbelievers while he himself traversed the entire continent embracing presidents and governors and traditional rulers celebrating their birthdays and is too. In the 90s, who, who bore you to celebrate birthday? You can't. Kumu, you just cage lives, cage destiny, cage a lot of people. Celebrating our birthdays were never had of in Deeper Life Church before now. Not to talk of celebrating it. You cannot bake cakes, not even in your wedding. Can you believe all these things? I didn't allow them to do all this to me, oh. No. <laughs> there is a lot I want to say here, but I reserve my comments for another time. I will conclude by saying that Mr. Kumuyi be giving a befitting award as senior. Whatever you wish to fill in there. He's a senior destroyer. There's no other thing about it. A senior manipulators. Because he packages so well that you will never be able to see, to see nothing or hear anything. But I'm not surprised. The hand is near and very hidden things must be exposed. Yes, we are exposing everything now. Yes, we are. We are exposing everything. Let me read more, if time will permit me, because I have a lot to say in this video. I, and as you know, I don't like my video to be too long, because I really want people to enjoy what I'm saying. Yeah. So, another person wrote, all of them, including Adeboye, were busy every Sunday, displaying their tithes and offering bank accounts during all during the COVID, all their online service during COVID, lock, COVID-19 lockdown, when their mates in civilized world were giving free all day meals, it is a pity. Yes, that's what we got in Africa. During COVID lockdown, American churches were giving money back. They went into their accounts. They give you everything you have donated back. The one that I donate 1000 since you've been there, they give you that money back. And we wonder why God is blessing all these churches and left all this one. So, another one wrote, this Baba is our biggest problem in Southwest. They are not lying. No. <clears throat> all these Baba, not this only one. All of them are the Oh, yeah, they are Kumuji, they are our problems. They are our problems. And the small, small one now, even join them. So, now making lives difficult for everybody. The GO doesn't seem to have the authority to speak against evil. No, they don't. That's why they have to use domineering. That's, how to, that's why why have to use uh, lies and deception to keep people in bondage. Because if you don't lie to them, you cannot keep them in bondage. You, you have to make the lie look as if it is the truth. Then, and because of the trust, because nobody actually thinks that people will be lying on the, on the altar. I never believed it. I never think it will ever happen that people will lie on the altar. So, what wrong with this man? He need to sit down. All of them. Because they are still roaming about. Oh. They are still roaming about. And that's what we are saying. 
They are over 80. When are they going to stop destroying lives? That is my question. So, where does Jesus say we need to fire to, to subdue the enemy? These people evidently don't know the God of the Bible. All this fire, 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 fire they are talking about, it is not in the Bible. It is not. The word of God is just man-made. That's why me, I'm asking you to know God for yourself. Remove yourself from the bondage of all these men. They have nothing to offer you. So another one rose. Adebo's prayer is the opposite of the New Testament prayers. All of them know, not only Adebo. To those who killed Jesus, Jesus prayed in Luke 23. Father, forgive them. Jesus embraced Judas Iscariot, who betrayed him. Peter and John in Acts 5 were rejoicing after they were flogged. Stephen in Acts 7 asked God to forgive his killers. Paul and others were beaten and rejoiced in their afflictions and prayed for those who afflicted who inflicted harm on them. Those are the Bibles. Those are the followers of our Lord Jesus Christ. You can't see all this in any of your Jews. They are all locking up. Anyone that criticizes them, they will lock them up. Another one wrote, Jesus Christ is referred to as the way, the truth, and life. Christ is not referred to as fire. The scriptures the scripture tells us we will be filled with the spirit of the living God. Therefore, we carry the Holy Spirit. So, where is the space to carry fire? When the Holy, when the whole space is filled with God's presence. Adebole, fear God, though. It's all in the name of money. They are just bamboozing your brains just to get your pockets. Some of them even preaching kingdom now. Someone that belongs to Satan is preaching kingdom to you just for money. Another one wrote, God, please, why did you give us DK Olukoya, O Lucifer? Not only Olukoya, all of them. Oh. Why did you give us Kumuyi? Kumuyi started it. Then Adeboye followed. Then Oyedepo followed. God, this guy should have been from Iran, Iraq, Afghanistan, Pakistan, Somalia, Somalia, or Libya. God, we know that you don't make mistakes, but on Dike Olukoya, O Lucifer, and the rest of them, and all of them, there they seem to be a mistake somehow. You see? People are in pain and people are lamenting. They are in pain, they are lamenting. These men have caused a lot of pains, a lot of damages to, 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 to many souls. So, another one wrote, Kumuyi is rumored to be part of Freemasons and other fraternal organizations. There's no doubt about that. We know all that. We know. If his followers weren't so blind, they are. And they will turn the Bible upside down. They will come here now to fight. They would, they would notice that his wives were sacrificed for his wealth. He has bewitched his members. Even um, Pastor Prophet Adebayo said it. I've done a video about it. Go and watch it. Go and watch it. When two or three are saying something, even in the court of law, in the court of this world, one, two or three people say the witness against you, that's it. You are gone. The judge will sentence you. And it's the same thing. So, in, in the court of God. So, um, another one wrote, that man said that Kumuyi's deeper life Title is from air fire. Yes. He was loaded with info information. 
type the Truth Channel Nigerian Pastor on YouTube. He stopped posting videos for four years now. He has 201 videos. He posted them since 2017. They are attacking any channel that is exposing them. They will attack you. They, they, they hire those specialized people. And those one, I just, I just feel pity for their ending because they will never end well, oh. Oh. They will never end well. So, um, this one, Sunday day like that now on the run somewhere in Ivory Coast, he hire people to be going through my videos, reporting my videos, and all that. They are still doing that. All of them are doing it. Oya Kilome is doing it. All of them. Anyway, let me read more. Wahala Deo, Olukoya, O Lucifer is producing mat mana water. It's an fire, a water of fire. His, his member, Abizio, saying he doesn't sell water. He doesn't sell water. If you go to Prayer City, water is everywhere. All the vendors, they are under him. Olukoya is so smart, smarter than everybody, that for you to trace him to any atrocity, it will be very difficult. He is using a uh, uh, human shield. He is using people. And once you are busted, they will just unpile you. So what happened to Badamoshi now? Badamoshi, they've kicked Badamoshi out of, uh, out of the uh, MFMO. They kicked him out. I went to Badamoshi Facebook. They've deleted all the videos, all the information, his photo and everything. You cannot see by the machine photo anywhere. That's what they are doing. Once you are busted, that's it. You see what they did to um, that one that's, that's saying, the singer that is late now. Sami Okosu. Once Sami Okosu busted, all of them rejected that guy. That guy is dead now. He's dead now. They didn't even attend his funeral. That's what they are doing. All of you that is working with them. Once they use you as a shield and you are busted, that's it. That's what Satan does. So, Igela constructed the pool of Bethsaida in his shrine. Papa J is currently producing soap to wash off spiritual odors. Can you imagine? That one, the one seer gave him a challenge. He didn't do that one, no, he ran away. Oh. They went behind the curtain to settle the guy. They have settled the war the, the, the war here, Ghana. They settled the guy. So, that's what they are doing, no. Hmm. All these men, all this liar, 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 liar. My people, know God for yourself, oh. That's what I'm preaching, no. <clears> hmm. <throat> this one wrote, ah, this one is about, uh, the, um, about, um, what is it called? He left this message under my video uh, about um, Sunday Adelaja. <clears throat> and I like this. He wrote, he said, DSA failed himself. His family, his kindred, his underlines, and his nation. If he was serious and honest, he could have done great things. However, he has a devious, narcissistic, Black heart. God has ruined his enterprise. He will not prosper. That's it. Millions of people are raining curses on Sunday Adelaja on a daily basis. All of you that is still on his uh, platform, you better carry your head if you don't want to be a partaker of all these curses that they are raining on, on, on his head. So, let's move on. Another one wrote, Sunday Adelaja was a big disappointed and fooled and fooled many with his intellectual tool of being an author of well titled books. A big trickster. All those books they were copy and paste oh, from people's books, so oh. they are not his, oh. That's what he does, oh. <clears throat> Ah, Jesus, have mercy, have mercy. Another one wrote, You don't have to be specially anointed or gifted 
with the ability to dis to distinguish spirits to know that he is a criminal, a a spiritual and financial vampire. This person is talking about Sunday Adelaja. But it's not only Sunday Adelaja. He goes to all of them. It's only that Sunday Adelaja is 100 times worse than all of them. All of you, you see what he did to Kumuyi this year. So if you don't want to believe me of everything I've been saying, what about what he did to Kumuyi this year? <clears throat> he used that man. Thank you for exposing these spiritual rats. They are rats. They have no power. Someone even said they are principalities without powers. Don't let them lie to you. Don't let them destroy your life. Know God for yourself on your knees in your closet. That's how we know God. The Bible says, Before I was afflicted, I gone astray. Your problem is peculiar to you. They cannot help you. They will only add to your problems because they will collect all your monies. They will collect your skills. They will collect your destiny. They will add more to your problems. You can only find solution to any of your problems on your knees, in your closet. No God one-on-one. -on -one. Make sure your hands are clean. That's, that, that, that's the way out. So, this lady wrote, she said, my 10-year-old daughter says that this lady must be very angry with someone because her emotions say so. And I feel exactly what you feel. You know my story with this Kamas. Yes, they dare with this sister. Ah, God Almighty. Now, let me round off with Kumuyi ranting. Stay tuned to the end been born again and they don't have that miracle all they are having they come I praise God I came last Friday I didn't have uh, any five cobble on me and when I was going out God gave me five naira and so what my friend go and sit down five naira God gave you five naira I got a miracle five naira is a miracle I, when I came last Friday, before I came, I was going to toilet, and uh, then I came. They mentioned my problem, and after that Friday meeting, I didn't go to toilet again. Praise God, I have a miracle. Go and sit down. <laughs> the people that will say, as members of the church, here I am. I'm a member of this body of Christ. I don't care for persecution. Though he kills me, yet I will trust him. That's a miracle. People that will rise up like Esther. If I perish, I perish. If I lose all my friends, I lose all my friends. If people hate me, that's all right. What I will do for the rest of my life is obeying the Lord in every detail of the word of God. That's a miracle. But five naira. Headache. If that's all the miracle you've got, I don't think we'll meet in heaven. Thank you, my people, for watching. See you on my next video. Bye for now.